so today um kyle's had a day off so we've been chilling we finally got little man's room done uh finished it on finished it on friday saturday started moving things into it on saturday so that is a great weight lifted off my mind i can finally focus on myself which is fantastic and i've started eating healthily and so far so good in fact i even made like this banana this banana style ice cream what you do is you get like two bananas slice them up and stick them in a freezer bag and put them in the freezer for like a couple of hours then you take them out and put them in a blender blend them all up and you add a tablespoon of peanut butter and then you blend that all up and what I had to do is I had to add a couple of teaspoons of um, hot water just to sort of like melt the banana a little bit to make it a bit a little bit more pliable then when it got to like a the ice cream sort of um, consistency then I put it in like a uh, freezer sort of like a tray thing so then I put it in the freezer to freeze up and it was absolutely delicious the only thing is I did use slightly under ripened bananas so they weren't that like um, sweet which wasn't very good so I'm going to try it again next time when they're a bit riper should be good then but I'm really looking for like these simple like cheats ice cream sort of like cheats sorbet recipes they're really nice and for anybody with a sweet tooth like me it's like cheating having like ice cream which I think is fantastic because it means like you know you can get sort of like the feeling like you're having ice cream but you're really not you're just like having like a fruit pureed up and then frozen it's just amazing so um thumbs up to those guys who made those sort of recipes I don't know who did them but amazing amazing um, I found this one on Pinterest which is like a mango soft serve, like sort of ice cream type thing and I'm really looking forward to trying that. I also found like a peach, sort of like a peach um, soft serve ice cream as well. They all look so amazing though so I'm going to have to try each and every one of them. Um, also today, um, we've basically been chilling most of the day haven't we Kyle really? Um, I came up here to do a bit of vlog editing earlier, that sort of didn't happen, um, little man has been, so oh, I did ring up about little man's um, nine month appointment, um, but the health visitor said that I should get a letter through the post, um, so I haven't been missed, but I thought maybe I've didn't know, understand why she couldn't make me an appointment anyway just to put my mind at ease <laughs> but hey ho um, she said that's the routine that they do so I guess that's the routine that they do um, but yeah a bit baffled about that so because um, I'm really concerned about little man's weight he he looks like quite a tall baby but it makes him look quite skinny and underweight and I'm not too sure whether if he's underweight or not but he thing is with him he only like he only drinks when he wants to drink and he only eats when he wants to eat and if he's like really fussy um like for example if he's got like a overly wet bottom or whatever then he will you know be really fussy and stuff so then we have to change him but then when he when he's in the wrong sort of mood like if he needs a change and then we change him and then afterwards he still doesn't really feed all that well he's just a really really complex baby um in the way that he he, he eats he's nine months and i'm struggling on getting him onto like food with bits in he'll have like finger foods like the soft um like the little sort of like uh, corn snacks that melt on your tongue and stuff he'll chew on them and he'll chew on rice cakes and the little biscottis you can get but when it comes to like um, 
like for example like shepherd's pie with little bits of lumps in he hates it and he ends up nearly being sick so i don't know what to do um it's really quite confusing really and it's really worrying for me so that's why i really wanted to make the appointment with the health visitor but clearly i couldn't so that's just a really really like it's an annoyance really annoying i just hope um i can keep trying to feed him up you know I do worry about that little guy. He just means everything to me. I just don't want to do anything wrong. But yeah, so, um, and yeah, that's all we've really done today because basically we've been so strung out on doing the um, nursery and now that's done, we just want to relax. So, yeah, so I'm going to call this a night, guys, and I shall see you in my next vlog. Bye.